Hey there, I'm Amanda. Also go by Keto Ginger, wife, photographer, keto lady. And my best friend bought a farm that has turned into our outdoor studio. So you guys are gonna be seeing a lot more of my work days because that's what I do. Today's set is a milk bath. It's gonna be beautiful. I wanna show you guys the angle. You're gonna freak. Isn't this incredible? So we're gonna take a super beautiful woman and shoot her in this super cool set. Set, it's Jenny's yard, isn't this insane? This is what it takes to be artistic. Like, can you even, this is our real life. Jenny, you happy right now? So happy. <laughs> gonna be worth it. ADHD would stop making me forget to buy the damn longer hose. I know. That's on my big lock damn list today pressure. with Christmas lights. I hate you so much. <laughs> it had to come down. She just wanted to take that plant out so bad that she mucked through all this greenery. Milk bath went amazing. I couldn't show you guys any footage because it's a surprise anniversary present for her husband, but I will be sure to post something to let you guys see it when it's done, but it was everything that I hoped it would be. So I am a mess because it's Florida, so it's still super, super hot and not really fall at all, but I'm doing computer work and just catching up on some stuff and then I'm gonna go get my kiddos. I haven't eaten anything today. I'm really liking doing the one meal a day situation. So I'm typically breaking my fast around five o'clock in the evening with a super heavy loaded bulletproof coffee. Think all the things creamer, a little bit of butter, pumpkin pie spice. I just really load it up and have an incredible bulletproof coffee. And then I have a pretty enormous dinner. And that's working for me right now, especially with my busy workload. So I don't like to call these a day of eating, but it's definitely a day in the life. And I'm getting things done, feeling really motivated. I hope you are too. And if you're not, that's okay. You're still awesome. I just got home from picking up the kids from school and we're going to do our nightly routine and chores and all of that. Like I said, I have been doing OMAD, which means one meal a day. I eat a really, really filling dinner and I break my fast in the evening around this time with a Bulletproof coffee. Now this is no ordinary Bulletproof coffee. It has all the bells and whistles, definitely caloric and fatty enough to be considered a meal. And I just look forward to it every day. It's very pumpkin spice super creamy, super rich. You're gonna love it. And I wanted to take this opportunity to show you guys what I found at Aldi. <sighs> that is pumpkin spice whipped cream. Now, if you are someone who does has to be perfectly clean ingredients, so on and so forth, you're not gonna like this. But if you're someone who just does net carbs, it's only one net carb per serving and a serving is perfect to top a little coffee with. They also have a maple vanilla one. Peep your Aldi and see if you guys can find these. They're such a nice treat. So let me show you what goes in it. First, coffee. Okay, here are the all-stars and you can probably start to pick up the pieces on why I consider this to be a meal because we're adding some half and half. Um, this is my favorite. It is a coffee house half and half. I find it at Publix and Target. It has more cream than it does milk. So super low carb and much richer. I absolutely love this. I'm also adding a little bit of the Omega Power Creamer in the pumpkin spice flavor. And then I will add a little bit of this from Explorado market this is sweet toast cinnamon sprinkle it's like a cinnamon sugar mixture that you could use for toast or french toast but i love it as a coffee topping so to my hot black coffee i'm going to add about a teaspoon of the power creamer i'm going to add about a tablespoon and a half of the coffee house half and half 
I'm going to add some pumpkin pie spice and about a quarter teaspoon of pure stevia, but you could use any sweetener or you could omit it. Then we're gonna blend it up till it's nice and frothy and the topping's the best part. Absolutely gorgeous, bulletproof coffee. I'm going to put a very small squirt of this pumpkin spice whipped cream. And then just a dash of the Explorado cinnamon sugar. And that's it. This is what's breaking my fast right now. Pumpkin spice, bulletproof coffee. I'll see you guys for dinner. Every year for the past few years, I have come up with some version of a pumpkin spice coffee. This one is hands down my favorite. If you are watching your calories super close, you're definitely going to want to do it as a snack or a meal, but I'm obsessed. Dan is not an enormous coffee drinker. He is not an enormous pumpkin spice lover, but even he requests this, so I know it's the best one I've ever done. I hope you'll try it. Dinner time. Dan is on dinner duty. I made a huge batch of my famous coleslaw and he is making big, fat, giant burgers. I'll show you when they're all done. And that's it. That's what I ate today. I told my husband that I didn't eat enough today and that I really needed something fatty and filling and comfort. So he made monster burgers. They have cheese and bacon bits inside and they're about 12 ounces a piece at least they were raw so i'm about to be in heaven i made some coleslaw i've got some of my favorite condiments here i really like this when i can't get the alterna sweets we use regular hellman's mayo feel free to judge i am so happy with it i love mustard pickles oh i'm so hungry so here it is all dressed up. We love burgers when we're craving something fast food and super easy and there are so many different ways that you can jazz this up. This is really good with like a Swiss and bacon situation, barbecue and bacon, sugar free of course. My coleslaw is legendary. I will link the recipe video up above and I will link the actual recipe down below. But I'm gonna go eat this incredible dinner. Hope you enjoyed seeing what a regular day looks like for me. I'm still steadily losing around a pound a day and I feel so energized and so amazing. I'm just gonna keep going at full speed. I hope you guys have an absolutely amazing day and I'll see you really soon.